Hello everybody, welcome to Carrots Gaming. I'm your host, Carrots. back at the game with some more and we're playing the amazing mod, Awakening of the Rebellion. Um, so, last episode... Also, by the way, we did actually fix the problems that we were having with the lag. Turns out, for some reason, everything got turned up to maximum, including bloom, heat distortion, all that sort of stuff. I don't know why I turned all that stuff off. I don't really need it. It looks fine without any of that stuff. I don't know why it was on. Um... Okay, quickly. In the air. In the air. And then we'll drop down the rest of these troops. Immediately put you here. Fleet lead. We took this plan here. Which is good, because that's got a decent pop cap. Not a lot of pop cap, but hey. Mining facility, meaning we can also put a manufacturing base on this planet. Which is good, because that will give us a, bun a good old boost in credits. Hmm. Alright. Ortabana is going to be our immediate next target. That will, like, probably be our next battle if I have a say in the matter. Um, you desperately need a fleet lead. We're still recovering from this terrible boss. We're getting this up. This has actually ships offline ready for it, so let's get these reinforcements over to here. Um, we're building up a small flea over here of corvettes and gunships. So that'll be good. Put you here. And we're definitely going to have to subsidize. We'll actually probably spend a couple of credits on that now. Getting a pair of, just a couple of cheap fighters. Full squadrons of Z95s. Alright. Now, before this battle continues, I'm going to immediately send forces over. How's our fighter strength? It's not too great, honestly. Like, it really isn't. But I think we have enough with the... If we use the neutron star bulks, we can maybe keep this fleet. Alright. Alright. We already know that way. Move over to Solist. Let's have a look at this. Does it matter which one of these plants I take first? I actually don't know. It might actually matter. Shockingly, this is weaker than Eridu. I might actually try and take this. Depending on what they have in the air. Because what they have on the ground on Eridu... Like, let's show you. Let's look out here. Let's memorize it really quick. They'll be good against fighters. They'll have a small defense. They'll have a large defense fleet, so they won't have any added units, so that's good at least. But, like, take a peek at Eridu. Like, Eridu's garrison. Gar garrison? Is it garrison or garrison? I honestly don't know. Is a little nuts. It's got a tier 2 in space, a tier 3 outpost, a small landing platform shield and a shield generator and a large defense fleet that's a bit much and that's an understatement um i assume that would be yeah those are that coming offline let's move these guys really quickly here just so they're in route Getting ready to have that battle here. We're going to be getting credits boosted soon, so I'm going to immediately put something on the ground here, because we might actually get that before the week's over. And with Solist, because if I'm remembering correctly, can recruit service, can recruit Solist and Sword, can produce Bellator's gonna I believe after we take Solist, we get access to Solist Tech. Which is good, because we need that if we're going to have quasars, or dauntlesses, or anything like that. And... Are we going to get paid before the week's over? And... We just got paid. Let's take a moment... To put some defenses down. Dear god, we're already broke. Okay. No, we have to do that, because it's a frontline world. Ah! Hi! Hello there! How are you? You're looking nice today. Tom! Ah! Uh, and 
this, boys and girls, is why... Oh, interesting. That's why we put this here. That's fascinating. Okay. Oh, that's a problem. That's such a problem. If they decide to attack this, I don't know what kind of forces they're working with here. We'll at least get a heads up, I think. Dear God, why? Why is that a thing that's occurring? Pause this. Go to here. How you doing? You're almost off the line. That's good. Let's fight this battle, and then we're gonna have to retreat. Alright, let's get this thing started, then we're gonna have to retreat immediately and try and deal with this, because dear lord. Alright. Move out this way. Hmm. Let's get this guy. You move out this way. Let's get this. This is going to be... We're dealing with the, the Empire, so... If we're going to be dealing with anything, it's going to be a victory. Which means our classic thing of three, five of these and a shield generator isn't really viable. I'm thinking we lead with just tank. We'll, we'll set this... We'll do these two capital ships. We're going to actually have to do two capital ships. 35... 35. That'll take a big chunk of our fleet cap, but then we'll have to build up with fighters. Lando might hopefully be able to bring us in something good. Alright, let's have a look here, make sure we're not walking into... Let's actually not do that, that'd be dumb. Continue hard burning this way. I think technically we'll be able to, with these scouts, be able to see anything before they actually send it. So continue moving this way. Let's speed this up just a tad bit. Alright. Let's have a look. Alright. Kind of to be expected, they do have these guys. Hard burn that way. And we're actually going to bring out fairly close MC-75. Let's get this fleet started out here. Alright. And then pause and then think about this. It's the Empire, so we're going to be dealing with ties, overpowered ties, if you've been following any of the escapades that have happened since the buff. Or bug fix that just ended up being an accidental buff for ties in any storm fighter, really. Let's not bring those out yet. Um, let's make an attack group of these guys. Make sure our fighters get out. Okay. Alright, alright. Well, that was a mistake and a half. I just accidentally stopped recording. But I immediately started it again, so... <laughs> you guys won't even notice a difference, probably. Alright, start turning. Start turning. Start turning. Start turning. Bringing you, you. Make sure we have good escorts, and then the rest will be these guys. I'm gonna deal with the anti missile tech to we'll leave that to these guys. And it seems like they might be coming to us, so hold. Pause. They're stupid enough to be doing that, so let them. Do not auto-cast. Do not auto-cast. We desperately need that to not be auto-casted. Start moving out. Not that way, please. Or you'll be weird, whatever. Uh, you... 
bring in something. Okay. Group one. Engage. And group two, you guys are our better fighters. Move out to here. Don't really go in and intercept unless you have to. Our Corvette and Capital Killers, group three, move out to here. All right. Hey, why don't you get involved here? Keep here. What did you... Ooh. Okay, not actually bad. I will take that. And now we have a group four, which is a nice group of... Okay. You remember what I said about that? Fall back. Because here's their ties. They're overpowered ties. When dealing with these guys, we have to be very, very careful and fight around this ship. Do not get drawn into a fight. Do not get drawn into a fight. Do not get drawn into a fight. Okay, now engage. Take out the interceptors. And please start dealing with some of these, please. Okay, they're running. Never mind, we don't have to fight this battle. <laughs> this is really cool, so I'm taking some screenshots now because it's just awesome. It's a clip good because this is a battle that never really happened, but doesn't matter. Oh god, look how quickly they're tearing through our fighters. And look how quickly they're not dying. <laughs> See, that's where the buff is. It's the fact that they're not dying nearly as quickly as they're supposed to. They're able to hold out in a fight. Which, if you know anything about sword fighters, there's a lot of them. If they're durable enough to hold themselves out in a fight, they kind of just wreck things, wreck face immediately. In long engagements, there's just no way to repel them. But there is going to be a debuff soon, which is good. There'll be a patch, so we have that to look forward to. Or to ban is now ours, because I do not believe there's a ground battle, unless I'm highly mistaken. I am. I see the little ground battle icon right there. Or is that... No, no, no. I think I'm just seeing things. Of course, the galactic map lags more than the battles. Yep, that's ours now. <sighs> okay, so here's how we're going to do this. It's a sizable force as well. Okay. We force them to come to us. They have to go through this checkpoint, so let's set up a defensive position around here. We'll start placing turrets and then fallback points immediately. I don't have a whole lot of faith in this, but let's get this battle started. Alright. Right, so they're launching here. We actually have this already. What exactly is he? Rebel training facility. Why is this capturable? Uh, our community base destroys silly will hamper the rebel cause. Interesting. We get sec force troopers from them. Anyway, uh, immediately. What a weird map. I can't even see the troops because of this weird thing. This is a weird ass map. Okay. Go back to that point. I like need to look and see what they got, but I can't. Uh. Move this way. Okay, pause. So while we're doing that, I want you all, everybody except you, to move out to here and attempt to reinforce. You three, you'll just, yeah, you run along too. Move at your own best speed. Try and find places to do. Also, 
reinforcements have arrived from the training facility, I believe. Oh no, this is just normal. Anti-infantry. Doesn't appear that we have any more... Oish, 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 oish. Okay. We need anti... Anti-air. Fall back to here. Keep going, sprint. We need the ability, ooh, back here, back here, back here. We'll get anti-air there. We'll get anti-tank here, because by then we'll have killed hopefully most of their, most of their infantry. Have you given us sec force yet? Oh no, we have to capture you still. Yeah, capture them, please. I feel like we should get that automatically, but whatever. Capture this point. You capture this, buy me that. Alright, we're just gonna go out into tactical view. Get all of these as a group. Three. Okay, looking good, looking good. Alright. And then we'll leave this here in case they engage this base with that. They'll be able to hold it off at least a little bit. Alright. Move out. Capture this. We are getting this, so group two. Fall back to here. Let's get all of our vehicles that are anti-tank or anti-infantry here. Do we have group three? Yay. Yeah, come group four. Fall back. You're gonna be my group three. I'm gonna grab you and all of you. You're gonna be my group one. We are capping this. Let's fall back to here. Where's that anti-infantry? It's way over here. Let's not do that then. Fall back actually. Why don't we fall back? Eesh. Fall back to this tank. Group 1, fall back to this tank. Or we're gonna have to hold here, aren't we? That was a dumb mistake to pull out here, wasn't it? Just stay here. Group 3, pull out this way. Uh, we. Oh, where is our anti tank? Do you mind doing air duties? There you go. Okay. Group one, again to engage. Group two, pull in to engage this as well. There doesn't appear to be a whole lot of vehicles here, so just engage this freely. Yeah, that's probably better. I just wish I could see what was going on. <laughs> engage this, please. There you go. Group two, they're in a perfect position, actually. Come on, kill this, please. Pretty please. Oh, it's in a straight line. Boom, dead. Thank goodness. What's happening here? What the hell? Oh. Okay. Engage. That's our entire scout group. Toss whatever grenades you have. I know you have grenades. We just kind of got back door, didn't we? What kind are you? You are... Oh no! That's bad! That's the bad kind! Okay, do we have any reinforcements? Yeah, we do have reinforcements. We do in fact have reinforcements. Pull back, and this entire force move out. Meanwhile, I said pause. Do I have any? Oh, this is all I have is for infantry. Oh, that's interesting. 
How did this go with hello? Do you have any infantry for me? You supposedly gave me infantry, but then you didn't give me any infantry. I feel like that's false advertisement. Alright, here's what we gotta do. Pull back to the anti-infantry turret. I don't actually know where that is. Over here. What? That's so weird. There's like a ramp here and stuff. Just pull back to here. I don't suppose you can actually hit ground, can you? No. Damn. I need you to pull back. Group three, engage. Engage this, actually. We need to just kill this as fast as possible. Oh, this battle went poorly and a half. Let's keep in track of you, group five. Continue to just assault them and hold them here. The more they're here, the more they're not assisting here. Okay, group three, are you doing your job against this? Kill this, quickly. Oh, okay, that's fun. Fall back. Everybody fall back. Get out of here. Get out of here. As far back as you can. Not very far, actually. I, 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 just fall back. Just fall back. Run. 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 Please, run. Leave. Flee. <laughs> Uh, God, this is defense has gone poorly and a half. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. Get to here. Hold, actually, till reinforcements come. Ha, huh, group two. Anybody alive here? Group three. Oh, perfect. They're alive. Zoom in. Where are you? <laughs> You're here. Okay. You're gonna have to be our new group two. And be ready for them to pull back troopers to handle this. And if not, if they fully engage with this, I'll do that. Oh, I'm so stupid. Get here, get here, get here. Get here now. I didn't realize there was one right here. I walked right past it. Group two, engage. Are those... No, those are those are army troopers. Oh, there's no way. There's just no way. There's just no way. Oh my god, way. Pause. All units. Engage. Keep this thing alive. Engage. Keep this thing alive. You guys... As much as you're terrible for this, you attack the tanks. You engage this. Keep them off of this tank. Please don't just explode immediately. God damn it. Oh well. That was my own fault. All right. Hold here and engage. This is a good place to be in, because we can kind of funnel them through here. Attack some of the weaker units here. Unit destroyed, I'm guessing that was my unit over here. Just kind of getting wrecked. At least we're fighting infantry. Are you fighting the right infantry? Yeah, you're fighting the infantry you can kill. Ooh, this whole thing went very badly. I'm hoping we can at least kill some of these guys that are funneled in this way. Yeesh. No. We do have more reinforcements. Get up here and engage this. We're pretty much, yeah. Fall back and meet up here with them. Get up here. Re-engage, re-engage. How are you still alive? Give us some... Ah. 
Come on, engage this, please. And thank you. There you go. Now engage this, please. You have rockets, use them. You're in range? Not the greatest, but hey, you're something. Engage, full with this. You're considered- what is this unit? What is it used for? Why? I don't get it. It's a distraction. Alright. Okay, just refocus on this. Yeah, this is done. The rest of these troops, which I don't think we're actually going to get much more of, needs to just hold here. Or even better, get over here. Do you get a defense blow? Oof. There goes our turret, which I didn't know we had. Tell me you get a defense bonus. Do you get defense bonus? I don't- I can't tell if you're defense bonus or not. But just engage whatever you can. Just stay- oh yeah, this is done. This is- this is just done. We're fighting a losing battle at this point. But please tell me we at least did a number on them. Please. I can't believe they backdoored us like this. This was, this was a, this is, yeah, this is a mistake. I should have gotten space stations immediately. I mean, they didn't pay for it that much. Oh, that was such a poor decision. Poor planning on my part. If I had gotten that defense turret there, I didn't know there was a bunker turret there. If I had known about that when I first went through, I would have been able to hold out way longer. Yeah, system lost. But, you know what? I think, yeah, we're gearing up right now to take it on. And I think I'm going to do that in the next episode. We're going to be retaking Polis Maza. I can't believe we lost it in the first place. That's just embarrassing. Alright, and then the next target will be Solus after that. Let us... See what we got going on over here. How's this fleet doing? Almost done with that. Um, oh yeah, always make sure you got this. Uh, yeah, this fleet's doing kind of poorly. At least, it's still recovering. Yeah, get, get in here, please. <laughs> this fleet needs screener protection, so that means the next bout of credits will go into... Maybe even this? Because this is great because of its point defense. Eight repeatings. This one has eight repeatings. Yeah, it has the same amount. I think it loses the dual TLs. Yeah, it loses the dual TLs, but honestly, not really needed. This is a good enough ship in its own right to be able to do stuff, especially with the extra squadrons of fighters, so we'll get a couple of these to be involved, plus they can give us, whatchamacallit, supplies, which I believe helps us, either heals us or helps us fire faster, I forget which one. I always kind of forget we get interdictors. <laughs> and also, I have a nice little raiding group here, which I'm going to have. Most of the commandos already here, I might launch that soon, and maybe in the next episode launch a quick raid, see what we're dealing with, maybe take this from underneath them. That'd be kind of cool. And do the same for this planet, then we have connected. Then we'd only have Telos. This flight's spooky. Hmm. All in all, not the worst battle that could have happened. I mean, they could have, like, uh, there's so much work. Yeah, like they could have gone over here. This is this is a big bad. This is terrible what I've done. I've done a bad. I forgot to put defense stations on all of these. That's such a in hind, like in hindsight I realize that was such a mistake. 
But I was like, oh, we didn't need that because we're not in front lines with anybody. I completely forgot Navarro is definitely front line. Anyway, I'm going to leave that one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe. If you want to see more Empire War, go check out my other playlists. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!